I've done everything I could possibly do leading up to this match. I'm the strongest I've ever been in regards to arm wrestling strength. My nutrition's been on point. All my preparation's been on point. Except coming at my best on May 28th. I have great respect for Devin Larry. I 100% believe he's been sandbagging. I fully expect him to be extremely powerful. Has he has he strengthened his hand and wrist? Is he going to be able to keep me from controlling his hand? Can he stop my hit? Will he have other options than a bent wrist press? Will his new king's move play a role? All these questions are going to get answered in 12 days. Witnesses around the world report seeing monsters. Are they real or imaginary? Science searches for answers. On Monster Quest. The answer to a modern riddle may lie with America's first inhabitants. There is some kind of creature out there that is a guardian. Do ancient drawings hold the first proof? This is Harry Man. And do strange howls suggest the creature still walk? The target frequency sounds some howling sounds. Just got so angry, I started breaking those limbs. Monster Quest launches expeditions deep into the heart of Michael Tom. territory. Yurok tribe member Margaret Carlson also tells of a more threatening side to the beast. We're taught not to look at him directly in the face because they can kill you if they want to. I have a champion mindset. I do. I have been very close to perfect um, since I got the call for the match. Very close to perfect. Basically, basically every moment has been dedicated to getting myself in the absolute best shape that I could possibly be in for this match. Yeah, I am coming in my very, very best. Michael's been saying that he just wants to slam me. My goal is not just to win. My goal is to completely destroy him. Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> if I see victory, I will try and make my victory larger. If I think that I can rush things, I won't. I will extend things. This will be my goal. And on the horizon, a strange dark sphere rising. It's fat Devin. An object so dense, nothing can escape its gravitational pull not even light. How did they form? And how did they get so large? In the search for answers, we are beginning to glimpse the forces that shape the stars, planets, even life. And now by tracing the life cycle of Fat Devin, scientists are finding clues to the fate that awaits and the universe at large.